This presentation will explain why the design of land development which controls the quality of our living, the value of our real estate, impact on our environment, developer and builders profits, and taxable income for cities has stagnated since the 1950s, and why today you can finally do something about this unsustainable growth situation. The world we live in evolves and improves at a fast pace, improving the ways we are transported, the way we communicate, the quality of the food we eat, the improvements in medicine that allows us to live longer. The technological explosion in both software and hardware has provided a higher standard for everyone, with one large exception the design quality of the very neighborhoods you may live in. The neighborhood design impacts your quality of living, your financial strength, your sense of space, and heavily influences the overall economic stability of cities in which the development is located. Land development design has gotten worse, not better, this past half century where everything else has improved. How could this have happened and what can be done about it? The designer or land planner's task is to shoehorn and squeeze every possible housing unit they can to maximize their developer client's profits. How do they do that? They use the most minimum dimension allowed, not an extra inch. Let's talk about the land planner who in urban redevelopment is likely to be the architect and for suburban growth, a civil engineer. Since many consultants charge a percentage of construction costs, their income is depleted if they gain the very efficiency, which reduces both housing costs and environmental impacts. Should an actual land planner be used, they are not fluent in the physical and precision requirements in civil engineering or land surveying, which often results in the original proposal either costing too much to develop or physically impossible to build. Thus, the initial sketch plan begins a series of time-consuming and costly changes, which is ultimately passed on to the consumer. That would be you. All of these roadblocks to good design pale in comparison to the damage that software automation has done to the design industry. Software developers who think that the ability to enter regulations most minimal allowances into their code and within minutes as one sweeps a mouse along a screen to create a neighborhood within a few minutes is progress are delusional. As a design software entity ourselves, we recognize that as the supplier of the tools consultants use to create their work, that it should be our obligation to solve the problems we created. The land developer who pays enormous design fees assumes the consultant will provide the best solution for them to have the market edge over their competition. A project achieves the highest density, but because of following the most minimal dimensions does so at the highest infrastructure cost. The city is left with the highest possible infrastructure maintenance expenses and mother nature is burdened with more environmental impact. To solve all of these problems and much more, we developed Land Mentor, a single, all-inclusive, standalone system of education, technology, and mentoring in the development of the solution. We must change the mindset of those that design and regulate cities, create the passion needed to bring quality of design to our world's growth. Intentionally complex and cumbersome CAD software with thousands of commands intended to design an airplane wing one day, a home's plumbing the next day, and the same core technology for land development has got to go. Land development design requires a very different set of functions. All land development begins with surveying, is designed, then ends with surveying stakeout, we needed to eliminate the problems most surveyors are not even aware they have. Point number management, which did not exist before computers. With Land Mentor, the world's first positional coordinate geometry, which can ultimately eliminate point numbers and their tedious management from the land surveying profession. For general land surveying and precision mapping, there is simply no better tool. Look around you. How many lines and arcs do you see? None. 
We live in a world made up of surfaces. Landmentor technology is the first intelligent survey precision surface-based core technology specifically created to allow its users to measure efficiency, report it instantly, and then with the included education, take action to remove the design waste. The results? A significant reduction in the infrastructure required to develop and redevelop. A demonstrated reduction average of 25% compared to conventional design methods as measured in almost 1,000 developments in 46 states and 18 countries harnessing the methods taught to those who invest in LandMentor. It's also the easiest. First, we eliminated commands. To make things even simpler, we developed the world's first alpha graphic prompting. All line work has comprehensive annotation abilities and textured screen graphics, eliminating the need to add a graphic design software to embellish plans. Everything, including the digital train models and images, are included within a single file. CAD's two-decade marketing promise of 3D visualization was never realized. How does Land Mentor solve that problem? With a single keystroke, the intelligent surfaces drape over the integrated DTM and sends the results to Land Mentor's internal video gaming. The total learning curve is reduced from months to minutes. Even the most comprehensive and detailed 3D tasks are easy and quick to create. On a 2D PowerPoint, it concerns neighbors imagine how they will be impacted by change. With Land Mentor, the impact is apparent. No more rendering exaggerations. What of the impervious surface for environmental impact? The developer who cannot visualize a 2D plan will be able to see what they're paying for. They can project themselves directly into their site using an Oculus Rift VR headset. PowerPoint will not make you a great presenter. Word will not convert you to a renowned author. And CAD will only guarantee that your work will be on par with others. Land Mentor is the first commercially available product of its type. A single solution, which includes an education on using the technology, but more important on every task from field to finish, how to do that task better, not just faster. Consultants investing in Land Mentor will learn how to significantly decrease infrastructure while preserving density without reducing any of the existing regulatory minimums. How to become a powerful presenter to expedite approvals and attract new clients. In addition, architects and planners will have a good understanding of engineering and surveying, and surveyors and engineers will learn how to collaborate with architects and planners to get better results. Cities investing in Land Mentor will not just have staff, but also their commission learn how to recognize, quantify, and report design waste at submittals in order to reduce excessive infrastructure, how to recommend changes for better connectivity, how to create better land use transitions, how to change regulations to encourage developers to go more than just the minimums. How to replace 2D site plans with communicative 3D interactive presentations, forever eliminating guesswork of what that submittal really means. In other words, Land Mentor will help cities become more sustainable. Developers and builders investing in Land Mentor learn how to make more profitable decisions, how to direct their consultant team better, how to judge if a property is a good deal or not how to increase the value of their lots and homes while decreasing construction costs. The Land Mentor System ultimate benefit is for those that will live, work, play, and enjoy a higher living standard in a safer, more efficient, and attractive development with values that will sustain themselves as time goes on. In conclusion, Land Mentor delivers on the unfulfilled promises that CAD software suppliers have been making for decades but have yet to realize.